Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to change your syntax with Discord Bot Designer. That's our really old name. Actually, I meant Bot Designer for Discord. If you remember what is the name Discord Bot Designer. Hi. Cool to see you use the app like two years ago. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to want to click on our settings icon. Settings icon is at the top right on the navigation bar. You can see them clicking on it. Also, it's a um, like little cog symbol, so once we're here, we can see a little bit of information, and I'd recommend going all the way down to the three buttons at the bottom, change privacy settings, change code highlighting settings, and our official community Discord server. If you're not already in the server, go ahead and join it. I think vanity URL is like slash bot. Anyways, we're going to click on change code highlighting settings. So here, when you click on it, you're going to be able to see that you're like, Oh, there's not that much information here, and there's really not that much information, there's not really much to change, and it's really not a hard thing to do. So you can change your default text, and we're just going to make the ugliest thing possible. Um, just basically to show you, so change the text color, and we're just going to make a blue theme. So it's all going to be shades of blue. And our final one. And there we go. We have a fully blue theme. Then we're going to go up here to the middle. And we're going to press apply theme. Give it a short little name. Oh. What? Um. One second. That's... Oh, no, I'm stupid. Excuse me. Okay, so... I lost my brain cells in the last few seconds, apparently. So when you share a theme, you press share. And this is what you're going to copy. So copy to clipboard. And then if you want to copy someone else's theme, you go over here. And you put that there. Press apply. And it will change the settings for you. So basically, like, let's say we did that. That. You go to apply theme, paste what we just copied right there, apply, and it'll be saved there. So now we can go back, and um, I'm not going to make a command for this video because it's supposed to be short. I'm just going to go commands. None of these are very good, but you can kind of just see what it looks like. And yeah, your colors are all there. You can obviously choose better colors than I did, or you can choose worse colors than I did and make like this like bright red and then make this like black and then make this a bright pink and that's a much better I guess coloring <laughs> makes it very easy to read okay thank you guys for watching have a great day don't forget to like subscribe and yeah comment what videos I should record next because I'm kind of Thank you.